Hey guys, uh, I just wanted to do a video on my new, well, I've been using them for a while, so that's why I'm doing this review. I've been doing this um, Bumble and Bumble Cream de Coco Conditioner. It's the best. I mean, OMG. Um, no, seriously, it's the best. I've been using it for, let's see, maybe like three weeks. Um, and I don't wash my hair every day. I wash it every other day. And this is, I mean, it makes my hair silky smooth. Now, I have this other product, too. It's called um, Bumble and Bumble Cream de Coco Mask. Now, this is like a leave-in leave treatment that you're supposed to do, like, once a week. And it just didn't work for me. Now, I have to tell you, actually, I forgot to say, that I have um, thick coarse hair so it's very hard for me to find those shampoos and conditioners that they have like a nice scent and then when you put it on the shower yeah it smells all good but then it, it kind of fades like you know there's some girls who are like their hair just smells good like when they pass by it's like oh wow that smells good your hair smells good what is it? it's like herbal essence or whatever like oh yeah that makes sense right they have like flowery scents and it smells really good but I never have that though because my hair is just so thick I think the shampoo and conditioner, the scent is just like, it. my hair just like, I don't know actually, I really have no clue why my hair never smells like pretty, you know what I mean? But I've been using this one, Cream de Coco, it smells like coconuts. Now if you love the smell of coconuts, you're going to fall in love with this. Oh my god, this is like the best smelling and my hair actually smells like coconuts like for the rest of the day. Like even if I put other products like you know, my hairspray or gel or whatever I'm using, you still have the undertone of the coconuts. And I'm just like, oh, I smell like I'm in, like at the beach all day. I don't know, coconuts reminds me of kind of like of sunblock, you know, and I use sunblock when I'm at the beach, really. You're supposed to use sunblock every day, but I mean, you know, you put more when you're at the beach. So, um, this smells so good. And let me tell you, it is eight fluid ounces, and it's kind of expensive. I got mine at the Carlton um, salon in my local mall. And it was $23 for only 8 ounces. So it is kind of expensive, but I do have to tell you, if you get this product, um, like I said, I have, I have pretty long, um, thick, coarse hair, and you don't really need that much. Whereas before, like, with other conditioners, like Biolage or, um, what else have I used? Uh, I only use salon products. I really don't use any, any, um, I mean, I like Pantene, Herbal Essence when I want to get... I don't know, just like a change. Um, but you know, technically salon products, you know, are supposed to be better for your hair. So, what was I saying? So you don't need that much. What's funny is this lathers up like a shampoo. If you guys have this product and that's happened to you, isn't it kind of weird? Like, it, you would think it's you're putting on shampoo, but you're putting on conditioner. So it's really weird. It lathers up like a shampoo, but it's conditioning your hair. And you'll, right away, your hair is like silky smooth. It's so soft. You, I leave it in for like two minutes, you know, while I do the rest of my body, whatever. And um, it just smells so good. It's like the best conditioner I've I've ever tried. And I've tried a lot because a lot of people recommend things for me because, oh, you know, you have thick coarse hair that only certain products will work for you which is true and um so this has worked for me definitely now uh, this mask was supposed to be like my leave-in once a week treatment that you leave in for like i don't know like more than like five minutes when you're in the shower once a week it didn't work for me um if any of you guys have used this product and it worked for you that's great but i don't know why this one didn't work for me this is also expensive this is five fluid ounces which is a little bit less than what's in here and it was even more it was 26 dollars um i'm actually going to return this one to my local carlton salon because um and i'm going to get like the bigger size of this one and the biggest size is like it's huge right? i don't know how many ounces it is but it's huge and it comes with the pump and it's like 50 dollars oh i know but oh my gosh it makes your hair so good and i swear this is the best condition I've ever tried compared to any other salon product that, that I've tried and this is just personally with my type of hair it's just worked for me right but this one didn't work for me I don't know why um it didn't make my hair silky smooth at all it made it like rough and like just not touchable at all or manageable at all I couldn't I don't know it just didn't work for me so that's not good because I do like bumble and bumble products um I've heard really good things about them I mean, they're like high-end salon products, so they should work, right? Um, but yeah, this one didn't work for me, but I just, 
um, I just had to just say that this is the best one. And if you guys have used it, like, put a comment like, oh my gosh, yeah, I do like it or whatever. This is like so good for your hair. You can, oh, it's so silky smooth and it smells like coconuts, you guys. I mean, if you guys are into coconuts. Oh my god, it smells so good. Um, so yeah, you can only get these like at high-end um, hair salons. Um, like I said, I got mine at Carlton, woo, which is in the mall. Um, you can get it at other hair salons also. Um, they also sell it at Target, but for some reason at my Target, it's like a little bit more. Like for this one, this was 23, right? At Target, it was like 26. It's the same product. I don't know what the deal is. Um, and I also heard that they sell it at Walmart, I think. But I heard that if you get them at those places like Target or Walmart or just like a non-salon place, you have to be careful because I guess sometimes they're not the right product, I heard. I don't know. It's kind of weird. But um, I would just be safe and go to the salon and it's a little bit cheaper anyways. So yeah, loved this one. Hated this one. Um, like I said, I'm going to return it hopefully tomorrow, going to the mall. And I got a Mac gift card for my husband for Christmas, so hopefully I'll use that one up too. Um, not all at once though, because it's a huge gift card. I mean, I want to like spread it out so I can be like, yes, my Mac card like lasts me forever. But we'll see, might only last one trip. Anyways, um, so yeah, I hope you guys are doing good. Sorry I haven't done a video. Um, I can't make this really long anyways, because my babies are going to wake up soon, I think. Anyways, um, so yeah, or you know what, leave a comment, let me know what shampoo and conditioner you guys use. Um, keep in mind, I'm going to look at them and maybe give it a try. And if I do, I'll let you know. Uh, remember, I have thick coarse hair. If you have thick coarse hair, you know, hopefully we can um, just talk about, you know, shampoo or conditioner you use. Um, uh, I do have to say, if you have thin hair, it's so easy, isn't it? I mean, to like manage or like straighten. Like it takes me forever to do my hair and uh, like up to an hour and all I do is straighten it. I mean, uh, I just, I love those girls where like their hair is just like, they wake up and it's straight and non-frizzy. I'm like, what the heck, dude, I have to put like five different products for my hair not to get frizzy. I have to use certain products for my hair to smell good. You know, it's just, I think it's easier when you have like thinner hair. I mean, I'm not saying that, you know, it's easy for you guys too, but it, it's easier, I think, to manage too. Because if you don't have thick, coarse hair like me, it's it's harder to pull off, like, the wake-up look. You know, you, I can't just wake up and go. Like, I, <laughs> unless I have it in a ponytail, then yeah, sure, I'll just wake up and go. But I have to, like, straighten it at least just to even look semi-decent. So, yeah, kind of sucks having thick, coarse hair. But anyways, um, so yeah, just want to let you guys know. Let me know what you guys use, and um, talk to you later. Peace.